Yes. The next so question to yes, Rabbi Abrahamson. Uh, Rabbi Abrahamson, uh, as Rabbi Hollander said that uh, you have Muslim friends and uh, you are connected with, with them uh, via internet and social networks, uh, and you share the uh, commonalities between Islam and uh, Judaism. How is the reaction to your works, uh, firstly, and how do you see its uh, outcome in terms of overcoming prejudice and uh, correcting the misconceptions? Well, I think I think it's essential to understand, um, you know, what is what is the meaning of of, of, of religion and, and 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 Islam. When people, uh, it says in the Quran that uh, there is uh, only one religion which is accepted from Allah, and that is Islam. Uh, so that sounds very exclusive. It sounds like there's one group that's it who will be accepted before God, and everybody else is 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 going to be gone. Uh, but the word there is used as din, uh, the, the, uh, the law, uh, and it's the same word that, that Judaism and the Torah uses for the din of the prophet Noah, peace be upon him. Uh, and what we're talking about there is the, the basic religion of submission to God, to, uh, to following what can be loosely called the Ten Commandments. There's actually seven commandments, but they're the, the basic uh, good deeds to be submit submit to submit to God, to do good deeds, to believe in the last day. These are things that are the fundamental of every, any proper believer. Uh, so, um, by explaining that there's a common root, uh, this is something that uh, Judaism believes. It's something that uh, Islam believes, and it's something that uh, um, uh, that Christianity has some semblance of this as well. That that uh, these commonalities aren't just accidental. The fact that we pray by, uh, by bending down, or that we pray standing, or that we uh, wash our hands before prayer, or that we do all these different customs, they're not accidental. It's because we trace to a common heritage from Abraham, the prophet Abraham, peace be upon him. Uh, so it's not just a matter of showing people that it's, it, it, we have common customs and common prayer times, but really that we come back to a common heritage and we belong to a common community. Uh, and the minute you understand that we're a family, then any conflict or any kind of dispute or any kind of uh, disagreement suddenly becomes workable because there's, uh, the, there's a, a, a language that you can discuss with other people. Uh, there's a, um, a beautiful quote, uh, let's see here, um, in the Hadith it says, the, the Prophet peace be upon him said, uh, shall I not tell, uh, tell you among who is the most beloved uh, to me and who will be the closest to, the, to him, to the, the Prophet uh, on the day of resurrection? And he repeated this two or three times, he said, those, uh, those of you who are the best in manners and character. And he repeated Marshall, this, this Marshall. is uh, Sahin Ahmad. Um, so the idea is that, um, that really we should, we should seek unity. Um, let's see, where's uh, another quote here? Um, in, in, in Surah Al Imran, it, uh, it says, Hold fast, all of you together, to the rope of Allah, and be not divided among yourself. And remember Allah's favor on you, for you were enemies to one another, but he joined your hearts together, so that by his grace you should become brethren. And you were on the brink of the pit of the fire, but he saved you from it. Uh, and thus Allah makes his uh, clear to you, and it should be guided. And if we understand that, that we're talking about true believers, the, 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 every time it says in the Quran it talks about Jews, it talks about Christians, it always says they're not all alike. There's a party that says this, there's a party that says that. It never says all Jews are like this, all Christians are like this, or even all Muslims like this. Yeah. There's always exceptions. Uh, so we have to realize that there are good, proper believers among each of the faith communities. Yeah. And, and from this, we, we need to not be divided among ourselves and remember Allah's favor on us. And this is a message that everyone who is even the most orthodox, fundamental Muslim relates to that and, and can find in that a, a sense of compassion and uh, uh, a common uh, terms with uh, with his brethren. Marshall,